Two sides of an animal abuse case happened in Bradley County today. The arraignment of the juvenile suspects and a show of support for the abused dog. News 12 Scott Coral has more on the show of support and the video that caused the outrage. It had only been less than 24 hours when the people of Dixie Day Spay here in Cleveland decided to come to the juvenile center and show support for an abused dog named Angel while the suspects in the case were being arraigned inside. These are blurred stills from the video because the images are horrific. One of the suspects in court today is the person administering the beating who later shot the dog. The other videotaped it. Several of those supporters at the juvenile center say it was too difficult to watch in its entirety. It was horrifying to me. Um, I'm an animal lover and I get goosebumps thinking about it. I don't know how you can hurt anything, period, like anything. Um, and just to watch that and that he just did it for enjoyment. To show the district attorney, to show the judges, we take this serious, it's not who we are, this is not what our community wants, and we fully, fully want him prosecuted to the fullest extent of the law. Betty Gravel of Dixie Day Spay says it was younger people who were so appalled by the video that they sent them to her to help do something. What she did was organize Cleveland and Bradley County to come together this morning. Those who couldn't attend sent heartfelt messages, which fits Cleveland's motto of the city with spirit. It really does, and every time that you do get disheartened and you do see these bad situations, it doesn't last long because you see who we really are and, and the people that are really here in their heart. The teenager who allegedly administered the beating to the dog was not released this morning, but was expected to be released on bond this afternoon. Now, the SPCA of Bradley County is actually next door to the juvenile center. Steve Anderson, a member of SPCA's board, says that you can go on their website and click on the Angel Fund to donate money in the dog's honor. At the Bradley County Juvenile Center, Scott Coral, News 12 Now.